Hey guys, welcome back to Random Vids, where I make vids that are not dumb, but random. Uh-huh. So today we're going to be talking about the ultimate way to count on your hands. Now from kindergarten, you've been most probably, if your kindergarten was good, learning how to count on your hands using 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Something like that. Now, if, if you've done that, let me tell you that you've got it all wrong. The highest number you can count on your hands without using your toes is 10. Now, there are other ways to count on your hands using math terms, using bases. Now, normal counting is in base 10, so the number 10 doesn't have one digit. You can't express it in, ex express it in one digit, so you have to switch to two digits. That's why it's one zero, not just one digit 10. Now there are other there are other bases like base eight and base two, which is called binary, and base sixteen, which is called hexadecimal, where they use letters instead of numbers. So one, two, that, I mean, yeah, that. You can count with using base two on your hands, where there's no number for two. Instead, it goes one, then one zero. It goes something like this. 1, 2, 3, oh wait. There are a couple problems with base 2 counting on your fingers. Now, the ultimate way to count on your fingers is basically, it's the way that abacus is used to count. Here, let me show you an example of an abacus. Okay, fine, it's not an abacus. It's not my abacus, but it's still an abacus. So the abacus, it basically has four, blue, four beads down here, called one beads, and this one bead up here called the five bead. To count on it, it starts from the right and goes to the left. So these are the units deep. These are more higher numbers. <laughs> so you start like this. All the beads are away from the bar in the middle. So like that. That's zero. So you start like this. One, two, three, four. So now there are four next to the bar. That means that the number is four. Now to have five, you push this down and all of these down. Now it's five. So for example, this would be 7. Hold on. This would be 10. And this would be 50. This would be 55. And 555, 556. 566. 766. You get the idea. Okay, back to hands. If you look at your hands closely, you realize that you have one, two, three, four fingers and one thumb. Whoa, really? I know, right? Okay, so back to the point. If you take a look at an Abacus, it'll have four blue beads and one, four one beads and one five beads. That's just like your finger. That's just like your hand. So with two hands, you can basically go up that much. Two digits. So you can treat it like this. One, two, three. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91, 92, 93, 95, 99, and that's the highest you can, number you can count on using your hand. Now theoretically you can count using base 3 on your hands, it's a little more tricky but that's fine. It's like this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, uh, 18, 27, 80 would be the highest number. This would be 80. Okay, I get it. Okay guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you liked it, both emotionally and physically, as in down below. Yeah, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. Have a nice day.